right guys, right here at Whipsnade. <sighs> another round, another round down. Let's see how we get on. Head to the grass range, hit a few balls, get warmed up, head out there. See ya! First tee, didn't do too bad first hole, um, made a bogey, which I'm actually pretty pretty happy about. Got up and down, um, two putted at the end, but it's what it is, it's better than starting around with, with 11. But second tee, I've shot two balls off the tee and I've lost both of them, so uh, swings and roundabouts really, isn't it? Double bogey on the last part three, so I was pretty happy with that to be fair. Um, now on the fourth, <laughs> topped it off the tee. Oh. Topped it about 100 yards and then got iron shot, went for a six iron, topped that about 10 yards and then sliced the seven iron, maybe 150 yards it's into the trees. <laughs> so <laughs> let's try and find it. So that last tee shot, it looked good, but it faded right off to the left. Well, drawed off the left, should I say, and it's not a bad lie. Quite stuck in there, but I'm quite close to this bush. So, yeah, but so I'm just going to play it safe, knock it back into the fairway, uh, just reset from there. Sam and Jamie are over there looking for a ball. I think the aim for this channel is just to be uh, a bit honest and, and just show you the pain, <laughs> the frustration and, and, you know, the good bits when you hit some nice shots. But, I mean, I haven't had any nice shots yet, but it is what it is. Um, yeah, just to be honest, really, and, and show you the progress and for me to really check my progress and see how I'm getting on there. It's not looking great at the moment. I've had a few tens. <laughs> We're only five holes in, so, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Tee shot from there. It's come along, landed here. Tees up there. Uh, pins up there. <sighs> Don't know whether to be aggressive and send it through the trees or just knock it back onto the fairway. And play, play sensibly. We shall see. Well, I put it out to the jury of Sam. Sam said I should have gone aggressive, so I did. And it went perfectly straight. It probably needed a draw on it to bring it back round onto the fairway. But yeah, it's up there, so I'm happy with that actually. 150 yards out. Let's see how we go. Two shots in. So, so far, shot 61 on the front nine, same as yesterday. Um, normally I'm warmed up for this back nine, but I just topped it off the tee about 30 yards. Oh, and just used a three iron to get it down there a bit and I managed to get so much loft in it it was like a bloody nine iron but that's how it goes part four we'll go this is the true realities being bad at golf you lose a lot of balls not today yeah, we'll take a penalty drop for that one. I can't 
can't keep making a habit of losing balls. That was off the tee, faded round straight in that bush. I don't know how I found it to be honest. But I knew it was mine, got the markings. Happy with that. in um, my back nine already is not it's not looking great for the seven nine six seven oh it's so demoralizing it's painful just done three off the tee punched it out of the tree onto the fairway but we just got to keep going keep going you only fail if you quit so just got to keep going news is though Got to tell you, I've um, got a lesson with a pro next week on Tuesday, so let's see how that goes. Hopefully, improve some bits and bobs, get me sorted out. Take a moment to appreciate that. Awful. Oh no, that the round's drawing to an end. Just like to take a drop off the 18. But took a three wood off the deck. Absolutely smashed it down there. Probably about 50 yards out. And I'll have it, bar five. Never done that before. But yeah, it's been, it's been a tough round. Like I really struggled on this one. All right. There's been a few times where I'm like, just go home. Put the bag away. Nearly ended up in a lake. I'll be honest. But yeah, I'll update you in a bit. Lovely shot now, Jay. So back home now after a long day at Whipsnade. Um, yeah, I've had some time to digest the round, and that was that was a tough one. Like, really struggled today. Um, like my mate said that you know they thought I'd sh you know did a bad round, but I actually shot um, 124, which was six shots less than what I shot there last week at Whipsnade. So. I suppose you know you could say that I did better. I mean, I didn't do as good as I did yesterday, but that course is a lot, a lot harder. It's a lot narrower, so you know you could put it down to the course. You know, maybe I did get a bit lucky yesterday, um, but it was a good, it was a good round. I, I took took a lot away of it. I t hit some good shots, hit some bad shots, lost quite a few balls. Um, I'm going to put the scorecard up here right now, um, so you can take a look at that. You can see where I lost the balls, you know, shooting tens, eights, and a nine. Oh, that's awful. Absolutely tragic. I think I lost two balls on one hole. How I made ten on it, I don't know. I just made some silly mistakes, absolute silly mistakes, like, you know, just not knowing when to take a drop. Like, I knocked a ball into the rough and I tried to strike it out and I striked it twice trying to get it out of the rough. And I was like, why don't I just take, take, the, take the drop? You know, get on with get on with the round. You know, but no, I didn't want to give up. <laughs> it was like I took the drop. If I'd have taken the drop, I could have been down the fairway by then. Uh, but no, it's I don't, I don't know. I just can't give up. I'm like, no, I have to get it out. I have to get it out. But it was quite funny actually because I I hit the ball and I must have only knocked it three yards. I knocked it three yards and the rough was so thick I lost it. And I was just like, I couldn't find it for nothing. It hit a tree and then bounced back into the rough somewhere and I could not find it for anything. And the worst thing is, that was a Pro V1 that I'd had for the most, like, that I dug out of that bush. And I was just like, so I went through all of that, scratched up all of my arms, just to lose it in a three foot strike. 
but great, but you know, is what it is. Um, but yeah, I've got I've got a lesson on Tuesday, so we're gonna see how that goes. Um, hopefully that goes goes well, and I take some things um, take some things out of that. Well, I definitely will because I've got nothing. So, <laughs> um, but yeah, well, you'll have to let me know what you think in the comments. You know, some tips, anything really, just to help push me along. Um, Cause yeah, I'm finding it difficult at the moment. Like difficult to keep going. Um, I know I've I've only done a few rounds, so I've got I've got a long way to go, a real long way to go. Um, but we're just gonna keep going. We're gonna keep keep persevering. Um, and I keep saying persevering a lot, but yeah, that's why I should have. It. I've got to keep going, otherwise, you know, I'm, I'm never getting anywhere. But yeah, I had some great parts, some real great long parts, a few chips. That I, that I was quite happy with, um, topped a few chips, chips, um, but then I, like I said, uh, it, I, I topped, I smashed a three wood off of the deck down the fairway. Never done that before. I was absolutely so happy with that. Um, so yeah, I can't complain. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. If you like the video and you like you like what I'm doing, um, smash the like, give us a subscribe. Um, and stick around and I'll put some more vids up so you know you can keep keep an eye on my progress, see how we're getting on. And hopefully you'll see some progress over the next couple of months. Um just for me to work towards my goal of breaking a hundred really. So yeah. Cheers for watching guys.